Good morning. Happy Tuesday. Today's devotion comes to us from 1 Timothy chapter 6, verses 12 to 16. And God's word says, fight the good fight. Um, but it says, fight the good fight of faith. Take hold of the eternal life to which you were called when you made your good confession in the presence of many witnesses. In the sight of God, who gives life to everything, and of Christ Jesus, who, while testifying before Pontius Pilate, made the good confession, I charge you to keep this command without spot or blame until the appearing of our Lord Jesus Christ, which God will bring about in his own time. God, the blessed and only ruler, the King of kings and the Lord of lords, who alone is immortal and who lives in unapproachable light, whom no one has seen or can see, to him be honor and might forever. Amen. So that first part, it says, fight the good fight of faith. And so this is called, fighting is good. <laughs> Don't stop reading this devotion after you read the title. If you pick a fight and tell people that your devotion book told you to fight, well, they might not believe you. When Paul told young Timothy to fight, he didn't mean at recess or when his sister or brother was mean to him. Fight the good fight of faith. That's the kind of fighting that God approves. But what does it mean? A short story will help you understand. Tommy got a tablet computer from his Aunt Tina on his 10th birthday. He loved it. He took it everywhere and played games. Tommy thought his tablet was the best thing he'd ever owned. So he took good care of it. He protected it with a heavy covering when he took it from place to place. Once, when some kids wanted to take it from him, he gave them such a mean look that they ran away. He would fight to keep his tablet. Well, God has given you a special gift, a precious gift of faith in Jesus, who fought the devil for you. Jesus died in the fight. He took the punishment that you deserve for your sins. The punishment was death, his death for yours. Then Jesus rose on Easter. He came back to life. Just like you and all who believe in Jesus will do after you die. Jesus fought to save you and he won. What does fighting the good fight of faith mean? First of all, it means you can expect to do battle with the devil, the world, and your sinful self. These enemies do not want you to have faith in God. How can you win? By yourself, you can't. But with God, you can. Your strength is God's strength. Your power to cling to his precious gift is God's power. And your victory is Christ's victory. So dear ones today, um, remember that. We are fighting the good fight of faith. And even when the stuff of this world, like the coronavirus and other things, come about that try and shake us, don't forget, we have a God who is always with us, and he'll be with us no matter what we're going through. And he loves us, and that's never going to stop. It's never going to end. So let's fight the good fight of faith, and let's keep holding on to Jesus today. And share that message with your parents too, fifth grade. <laughs> All right, well, have a great day. Talk to you soon. Bye.